Hi everyone, Emma here. I wanted to do a, a, just a quick correction on my last video of bezeling a crystal. Um, when we got to this part here, these were really rounded instead of more of a straight line. And uh, I prefer it to be a straight line. And I think what I did was, um, and I'll give you an example, I'll show you, is when we added these instead of coming out of the far side of the peyote bead so see how this one here the thread comes out of there and goes across so it gives it a bigger space for these to sit more in a straight line what i did was i came out of this bottom one and went around so it created that rounded effect so if you want the rounded effect, definitely do that. I would probably reduce it by one bead each row. But let me show you exactly what I mean. I'll just use this as an example. It's not quite a, this was, I was trying to make a smaller cage for a crystal. So I currently have my thread coming out correctly. So here's your corner. And this would be like your second row. So you would put a seed bead here. And then you would add your second row. So let's take a look. It's one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so we want to add five. This might be a bit longer. It looks like it's further away. So what I did was I came through this bead here, through that one there and then went around so it created this round and then i came down to this one and went through but actually what you need to go through is go to the next bead up and come from the bottom of that bead and across to the other side to its matching bead and then go through the bottom of that one like that <laughs> the um thread wasn't on the needle let me try that again. Okay, so it's this one might need a little bit more. Let's see, six. Ah, that might do it. Let's bring those down like that. So instead of going down like this, what you want to do is go through the bottom of the next bead. And that creates your straight line across. Okay, so that gives you this straight line. Let me try this one, you can see it better. So these are still a bit rounded, which is what I wanted anyway, but definitely in the video, uh, the way I had it was incorrect. So there you go. I will be doing a tutorial on making a bracelet with these and I will definitely do the front part as well and I'll most likely do a whole bezel like a refresher of it and then because putting the, the bracelet together is not going to take long so there you go thanks for your patience and we'll see you in the next video bye